What's up, YouTube? We're back. It's your boy, Mad Stacker. And we're here because I got some random stuff to tell you. So if you're wondering what that word was, it was a combination between the word show and tell, and it comes out to show you, show you. Anyways, I tried to say both words at once. It did not work out. So this video is being recorded for the second time, except this time the record button is on. I just opened this here package from Bold Precious Metals, and they were replacing the Milk Spotted line of England's, which was the first release in the Queen's Beast series. Y'all remember these? They came all Milk Spotted up on the Queen side there. So they have corrected that issue. They were completely expedient and graceful about it. Uh, could not have hoped for a better outcome. So big shout out to Bold Precious Metals. I was also showing you some recent finds in a uh, box. I actually had one more walker here that didn't have a hole in it, but I gave that away uh, to a guy that I was in Dallas with doing some sales training. But I got one walker, uh, actually two walkers, a 64 and then three six nine twelve forty percenters so right around two ounces of silver right there going in the stack and then i can't remember if i put these on a video before or not so i'm gonna go ahead and do it now just in case if i did it already then uh just a little double shout out to my boy gunner gunnerson these are crowns from uh england and these are uk or what I don't always know how that works. Is it Britain? Is it England? Is it UK? I know UK is like Scotland, Ireland, and Britain together, I think. Is the United Kingdom? I could be wrong about that, but, um, you know, just shows you how much they focus on that kind of stuff over here. So, um, these are two crowns from 1889 and 1890. I am in love with this particular coin. It's one of my favorites one of my favorite designs this is the jubilee design is what it's called um they've actually recreated this in a modern coin um which is pretty cool too so i did have an 1890 already that gunner had sent me previously um uh, through the mail so he also added this time a 1935 rocking horse crown is what they call it it's not the jubilee style this one's called the rocking horse of course the next in line on the throne was on there by that time uh, but this is super awesome as well. You see the dragon underneath the horse there. It's kind of being trampled by the horse. But it almost makes it look like it's a rocking horse. So that's why it got its name. The rocking horse design. So those are pretty cool. These are all going in my stack. And you know, once they go in my stack, they never go back. Hey guys, thanks for coming to hang out today. I appreciate each and every one of you. Come hang out with us soon. Thursday nights, I'm either opening coins on Mattis Stacker or I'm doing a Texas Connection game night with Everyday Copportunity. Friday nights, you can catch me on Steve looking for silver. And then Sundays with Oregon Stacker participating in an auction. Me and a bunch of other knuckleheads. It's a great time. Come hang out with us. Do not worry about fitting in this community because we are all mad here.